Cheetah, also known as the Rich Cheetah, right here on YouTube. And if you want to subscribe, go ahead. And if you want to like it, go ahead and like it. <laughs> so, anyway, so in today's video, I want to talk about day two, two curls. And it's been a long process. I have curly hair for about almost 27 years. And I didn't. I don't know how to treat my hair right, especially when it comes to curly hair. Um, I don't know what to do, especially during high school and middle school when we didn't have YouTube videos. We didn't. I didn't know how to do my hair, like for real. All I used was gel, curl it up, and then it would get all crunchy and all I'll look crazy, like I look like a mob. Like no, it wasn't cute. But as YouTube got you know bigger and I started watching videos, I started to see other girls and other people and talk about their stories of their curly hair and how they maintain it, how they style it, how they refresh it. And it's amazing, a little small community of curly hairs. <laughs> so I wanna talk about refreshing the curl. So yesterday I washed my hair and I'll, um, there's a video I'll link down below and it goes through in depth of the products I use. And I also have a video for when I had pixie, like really, really short hair. I also have that. I'll also link that down below if you guys want to watch that. How I maintained it and how I treated it because my hair was damaged. I had to cut it to a pixie cut. So yesterday I washed my hair, conditioned it, um, put a product. I put this product actually, the Carefree Gold. Care Carefree Curl Gold Instant Activator. That is a beauty supply store and I've been using this for 10 years. Yes, on and off 10 years. And then to maintain it, I'm going to use the, to maintain it, I'm going to use the Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair, Comeback Curls, Next Day Curl Revitalizer, No Sulfates, Silicones, Parabens, or Mineral Oil, Freshes Curls, Reduces Frizz and Shine, Made with Pure Shea Butter for all curl types. And this is a big bottle. And yeah. And it also states here to spray on damp hair section by section to restore, refresh, and revive curls, coils, and waves. Apply to dry hair as needed for additional moisture. And there's a styling tip. To before bed, lightly mist and gather in a loose ponytail. That's what I did. And top of my head to max to minimize, not maximize, next day frizz. So yay! Yeah, I had to do a thumbnail there. So I'm gonna take this off. Whoa! <laughs> All right, let's take this down. And be gentle to your hair. Nice. <laughs> I have a lot of hair, like a lot. Look at that. Barely any frizz. Cool. So I did wash it yesterday. And also when I was younger, I always felt the need to, when I wash my hair, have it curly. To wash it again the next day when I have it curly. Like no, you had to refresh it. You had to, too much, too much washing your hair will strip of all the oils and the hair will be dry, brittle, frizzy. That's a pro tip. So don't like keep washing it and washing it and washing it having it curly and curly like just leave it the way it is and yeah and also um i have dandruff by the way tmi but not tmi everyone goes through that come on <laughs> no um you gotta talk to a professional about it a dermatologist about it for me i find the head and shoulders um smooth and silky especially i've used it for the past couple of months and I haven't had dandruff since. And it's amazing because when I had dandruff, I had to wash my hair a lot. A lot. And it was so annoying. So, yeah. And now I barely have it. I could go three, four days without washing my hair. And that's awesome. I used to do every day wash my hair. And that was kind of a hassle and annoying. But anywho. So, yeah. That's my hair. So it states that you have to section by section 
So I'm going to do big sections here. And to this. Be gentle to your hair. <laughs> oh, that's a nice hairstyle. Ooh. Alrighty. Take this. I think we got to shake it or anything. And lightly. Make sure your hair is damp. Don't use this when you're here. I mean, make sure your hair. Uh, make sure you use this when your hair is dry. And then this is what I do. You could either do this right here, twist it up again, or just scrunch it into place, like so. And go over it. Get all this hair. <laughs> and then when you get to the front, if you want, um, just curl it back. And I find this method of wrapping your hair and putting it up in a ponytail to be so crucial to have your hair look great, help it look great for the next day. And, and it also depends on the products that you use. If you use gel, for me, I feel like your hair, there's going to be sometimes gel has like flakiness and stuff. And the next day you see it in your hair, you're like, ah, oh, I gotta wash it. Use natural products when it comes to your hair. Um... Stay away from gels, that's not my thing. But if you do find a gel that works for you, then go about it. Um, I do use gel when it comes to, like if I wanna like, have a sleek bun, I'll do that. I actually use this brand called Moco de Gorilla, Gorilla, Gorilla Snap Gel. And this is non-flaky at all. It has my hair in place all day. And I recommend this if you wanna have a little bun, brush your curls, and have a bun. Yeah, and the home meter is 10, so it has a really tough hold. <laughs> I sound like crazy, but what else? So, yeah, this video is pretty quick, and um, yeah, it's something that I've been doing as of lately, and I love it. Less frizziness and yeah. So I don't know if I'm gonna cut my hair into pixie again or let my hair grow out. Um, I've been doing this on and off for the past four years and I don't know what to do. The pixie always gets to me. I don't know. It's like so sexy, I feel like. Yeah. And so let me know in the comments down below if you guys wanna see me with a pixie cut or let my hair grow. Cause I do have a lot of hair and people always, they like that. You have like a lot of hair that I should be thankful, which I am thankful for. So yeah. If you guys like this video, I already said it in the beginning. So yeah. 
So thank you guys for watching. This video is pretty quick, pretty easy. Um, hope you guys um, learned something new today. I hope so. And yeah, try out the Cantu um, for, I'm not sponsored or anything, but try the Cantu Shea Butter for natural hair. This is awesome. It smells great. You find this in the ethnic aisle in Walgreens. And yeah, unfortunately, the ethnic aisle in the pharmacies is very, very, very small. When I mean small, I mean like the littlest thing. And I just wish that people will have more products cater to girls that have curly hair, girls that have textured hair. Which sucks that you guys, um, that, not you guys, like me, I'm included, I'm a Latina, I'm mixed, you know? So I'm Dominican and Puerto Rican, Afro-Caribbean. So, yeah, it sucks that we don't have that much products to choose from and... I had to go anytime I go back to the Dominican Republic and it's it anytime I go back to the Dominican Republic I always stock up on hair products so there's tons and tons to choose from and I just wish we had at least an aisle for ourselves you know we all have different hair we all like different things and it's not fair that we have to stick to this a couple hair products that you know so yeah have a great day. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. So I always like to leave like inspirational motivation quotes after I finish my video. I'm actually gonna do a video dedicated to to that specifically. And that's gonna be in the next video. And I wanna leave this video with always embrace your hair. But they have short hair, frizzy hair, um, short, long, not no hair at all. Uh, don't make fun of people because they want to wear their hair different. Don't make fun of people that have different color hair. Don't make fun of people that have like the side shave or anything. I had all that. People would look at me like, the hell are you doing? I want to do it. Like, let me be. Be, you know. Don't let all that get to you and love your hair and embrace your hair. That's all I gotta say. Bye! Curly hair, don't care.